Hey everybody, Sean James here. Welcome back to the cabin. Stayed on the lake fishing today all by myself. Took the uh, solo canoe out because this little back lake is hard to get to. So I had a long carry, so I brought my little light um, solo canoe that I'm in here. And it does not fit Callie, so she stayed behind with my wife while I go out and try to catch a few bass for dinner. It's extremely hot out th today, though. It's like my, or not minus, it's plus uh, 31 or something, plus 38 with the humid X Celsius, so that's around 100 Fahrenheit, it feels like. And no doubt we are going to get a severe storm. I think I can hear some thunder off in the background, actually, so I'm going to have to be careful and get off this lake pretty soon. So, short day, but nice to get out, enjoy nature, enjoy a hot day on the water rather than in the bush or working around the cabin, so I'm kind of thankful that I can get out on this lake today and that my wife's taking care of Callie. So after uh, the storm passes through I'll probably get back out and uh, take Callie for a walk. Maybe take her swimming somewhere. See how that goes. So what I'm doing here, just got a small plastic worm rigged kind of wacky style so that settles down slowly into the water. Uh, this lake is full of bass and some walleye or pickerel. So I am planning on bringing a few back to the cabin if I catch enough to make it worthwhile. I catch big enough ones to make it worthwhile to have a feed today and maybe tomorrow and the next day even. I would take advantage of these really prolific lakes that are able to produce a lot of fish where I don't mind taking a limit of smaller fish out to, uh, to enjoy some meals. And, uh, you know, between that and wild game and other fish, you can get a lot of my protein from the wild like this. So these are mostly largemouth bass. And uh, it'd be nice to get a walleye, but I do it in the middle of the day like this. So we'll see how it goes. Spend a couple hours out here. And I guess I get off the water before this storm comes racing in getting calm actually so this is the calm before the storm so I probably don't have that much time actually I'll have to keep an eye on that Well, unfortunately, I think that's it. I'm not catching fish today because I didn't even get out to the deeper part of the lake where the fish are at this time of day. And uh, that storm is moving in fast behind me. You can hear it, but I'm sure you can also see how dark it's getting. Might stick around, see if it clears out in an hour or so, and then come back out. But I think, I think probably I'll just head back and take Kelly out for a swim once it does clear out. Oh, I made it off the water, just I didn't make it to shelter, so I don't like standing under these huge trees, but I'll definitely stay under a bit of a canopy till this slows down a little bit. We do definitely need this rain though, so I'm glad to get it actually. Don't mind a couple of days off in the heat and the, the rain.